us where this arena is. Satan, I think you yeah. might, right? Yeah, yeah. Germany. Germany. Now, uh, the news is just out. Bayern München. München. 2022 NFL in Germany. I think this is new. Uh, home of uh, Bayern Munich. The Seahawks against the Bucks. That's fun. November 13th. Uh, here's some more on the story. Uh, Seahawks posted. We, oh man, my pronunciation. We were saying it's bald. I think uh, we'll see you soon. We'll see you. S E H E N is soon. I'm not sure. <laughs> and we're is we. I'm not sure about the other word. Oh, I'm going to translation. Um, What's that boy? I actually didn't look down at that. I'm like, I'm like, dude, it's right there. I hadn't it's even it, looked down at it. It says it right there. It says, see you soon, Germany. I swear like, I wasn't. I was like, wow. <laughs> I took one semester of German. But I don't. Hold on, guys. Let me translate this I didn't take any quick. semesters of German, and I know what it says. Well, I didn't it even says. look It's right there. Right there. I had never even looked down. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, we're coming. Let's yeah. go. That's what. Oh. How do you say that in German? <laughs> we'll look into that. But here's a tip. Now, it, this is very touristy, but also very cool. When you're in Munich, the Hofbräuhaus. House, this is the big beer hall in the ceiling, wow. old town of Germany. I've been there a couple times. It's fantastic. Um, it, it's fun. It's lively. Now, the greatest part about it is when the, the staff walks around with Remarkable. the beers. If they go like more than 10 or 12, People start chanting and banging their glass uh, steins on the table, and uh, it, it's pretty fun. Is that the average outfit, the one with the brown vest and the hat over her right shoulder? That is more of a traditional old school outfit of the later hosen. And that's an actual customer, that's not someone that's working there in a, some kind of outfit or costume. With Which the, person with, we With the red and white uh, checkered sleeve. How the, would we know? He's probably a customer, Todd. I just, I wanted, to me, that looks like someone that's dressed up. She works there, that's why she... But she's... how is she holding all those beers? Okay, you... they intertwine their fingers. All the glasses are pour up into, the, like the handles are on the inside. But then they pile up a few in your inner circle that's there. That's impressive. Uh, not only just being able to carry that many, but because of like the way your hands are, but that's got to be heavy. Oh yeah. That's well, got to be super heavy. Like, the glass is heavy and the beer is even heavier. Yeah. So when they when they walk through the beer hall, they're like, Boom. And they start pounding on the on the tables with their beer stack. It's a good time. And, and it's a bad time for Brady to not be a beer drinker anymore. Because mm. <laughs> he used to be a great beer drinker. We should bring it out for this. I don't know. Come out of retirement. I feel like they're cheating a little bit with uh, the poor. Yes. Yeah. They're pouring very fast. There's hundreds of people, hundreds of glasses. But I'm going to guess if you add it up and do the math, so... Still 10 beers. Each stein, yeah. hold, each stein <laughs> holds three and a half cans of beer. Like when they're full. So if you poured three cans of beer and a half of another one, that's how much Man, that looks like a good time. It does. I went there when I was 15. <laughs> 15 and we got ripped up. 